Okay. This one, similar concept. You got to be a little more careful when you're doing these cut-ins right here. This two by four, typically they're a little bit smoother wood than your standard fence, so you got to go just a little bit slower. But the same concept. Do your little shake. Rinse out your roller. Start at the bottom and slowly work your way up. Here, I mean, slowly is the key word here. Slowly. Just lightly push up. Don't push hard or anything because you're going to get stained. It'll just splash and, and drip. If you go too fast with this roller, it's going to feather out, stain, and it goes everywhere. So just go nice, easy, slow, steady, steady movement. We're not in a hurry here, not in a race. So we still got the same dip brush. Start at the bottom here and have a nice, slow, even stroke up here. You're going to have a little gap that you didn't get. That's all right. We're going to touch it up with the brush here in a second. There. Just work your way up. Always do your top ends. A lot of people skip it, but it's nice. I mean, it really seals in the stain all the way around around the wood. And then just do your same thing on this side. I mean, you're, literally, this takes no longer than five minutes per side. I don't know why people take. 30 minutes to do a cut in like this. It's not hard. It doesn't take that much time. So that part's done there. We're going to dip this a tiny little dip. I mean, I'm talking maybe that far onto the brush. Okay. Kind of shake it off a little bit. You don't need to hit it or anything. You one quick little tap like that. And that's good. So what you're going to do, you're going to start here at the bottom. You barely touch it, get that line started and you just keep your brush on the wood. Don't even look at the brick, okay? Keep Just keep an eye on the edge. You're not going to touch it. You're not going to hit that brick if you don't think about the brick. Just keep an eye on that wood. And just focus on keeping your hand perfectly straight. Obviously, I'm doing this. I would be doing it more straight on. For camera purposes, I'll try and do it like that. But this is how I do it. Just straight up. Perfection. So on this side, you'll touch that in there. Just that same concept. I really don't even need to, to dip it again. I'll just start in the same spot and work my way up. That's done there. I'll do one more tiny touch and we're done here. Within what, five minutes? Less. Three minutes. Done.